Hello, this is Rice No. So this time I'm going to explain how to handle user keyboard input. So yeah, how to receive keyboard input from users. And so we have created this game, Adventure. And uh, yeah, you can play this game by clicking these buttons, like uh, talk to the guard, or attack the guard, or yeah, leave, or yeah, fight, or so but maybe sometimes you want to let the user type something from their keyboards like uh, for example maybe you want to let the user input their name player name and use this name in your game so i'm going to explain how to do it by making a simple sample program again so let's start Okay, so this is a program I'm going to create this time. And so, yeah, please enter your name. And uh, yeah, there is a box here. And uh, inside of this box, you can type, you know, text here. So, and so for example, write no. Then you can click this button, enter. And if you, and if you click this, then message changes. And hello, write no, let's start the game. So the program received your input as a string. So now it, it can use keyboard input. Mm. So let me make this program from the scratch. Okay, so first let's make a Java project again. Okay, and the project name, something like uh, input sample, mm. finish. And create a class class name is like uh, input hmm. or whatever and finish first again we're gonna make a sample window so if you already know how to do it then uh, yeah you can skip this part new input frame window contain contain on Window get content. Okay, so a window is created. So now we're gonna make a J panel here and also J label here to display text. J panel. I'm gonna name this as text panel. Text. Panel call new J panel. Hmm. Okay. 
okay this time 150 250 500 100 hmm? oh no no set not to set the background to set the bounds text panel set background color blue and now J label okay I'm gonna name this as a text label label equal new j label okay why and uh hmm? ah no 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 label and uh i'm gonna type some text here so yeah please enter your name And text label set for ground color white. Why label and the text panel add text label. And con uh, hat text panel. Okay, so it's like this. Hmm. We've created this panel and then created this label and displaying this text. Please enter your name. But I think this uh, font is a bit small, so again I'm gonna make a custom font here and uh, make this font uh, a bit bigger. Hmm. Okay, so here font a normal font equal new font and the times new Roman. We're gonna use times new Roman and the font frame and uh, 26 and import and use this custom font to this text label so text label set font ah, again label normal font hmm. And let's move this uh, here. And okay. Yeah, like this. Hmm. Okay, and let's uh, okay. Let's change this to from blue to black. Okay. 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 So now we're gonna make this part, this text box, and. Uh, this button so yeah first we're gonna make uh, another J panel and uh, then on this J panel we're gonna place this text box under this button okay so another J panel here and I'm gonna name this as an input panel and let's make this input panel here input panel equal new J panel Bounds. Uh, no. Okay, for this panel, I'm gonna type 150, 450, 
set background color brack okay brack brack is fine brack and I'm gonna set layout for this panel and I'm gonna use grid layout and number is one two yeah I set this layout as one two because we're gonna place uh, two things on this panel the one is text box and the, uh, the other one is this J bottom we're gonna place the, this horizontally so one two so this one means vertical and this two means horizontal so one so horizontal one two and so next is uh, we're gonna make this text box and the place this on this input panel so to receive this keyboard input we're gonna use a class called j text field and I'm gonna name this as a, like a JTF or something and import let's initialize this JTEXT field here JTF equal new JTEXT field and add this JTEXT field uh, to this input panel at JTF okay and then we're gonna make this uh, enter bottom mm. Again, we're gonna use this J button like uh, enter B okay enter B equal new J button Enter B set foreground color and a black. So we're gonna add this enter button to this input panel. Add enter B. Hmm. And also we're gonna add this input panel to container con add input panel mm, add all, and uh, also okay let's type some text here so yeah enter mm, on this J button enter enter button okay okay let's check the program so yeah like this mm. okay so this text and uh, this uh, input box and this enter button are created so now now we just need to write a program to handle this input information and uh, put it put it in, into a string and display here and so yeah so I'm gonna create another handler here public class like uh, input no, input handler and implement action is now public void action performed action event event import and also import hmm. okay and also here put handler like a uh, mm, i handler all new input handler 
and we're gonna add this i handler to this enter button like we did before enter b uh, add action listener and uh, i yeah handler okay so now just need to add some result of this uh, enter button clicking mm. so yeah if you type something here and click this enter button what's gonna happen so you can write the result here so input handler and action performed first I'm gonna make string here string and uh, name this like a text and the equal so here so I'm gonna type like this JTF get text so this JTF is this JText field so text box basically hmm. so this JText field get text that was typed in the text box and put into this string called text so now you can use this text information and then like uh, so basically yeah you can type like this text hmm. so yeah let's check it okay hmm so if you type your name here write snow and click enter then write snow hmm. so it displays this received input like this so I'm gonna arrange a little bit here like a hello and text and let's start the game or something hmm. right so if you type your name here and enter then hello lights now let's start the game so like this you can let users input their name and uh, yeah and receive it as as a string yeah so now you can use it whatever you know however you want not only username but uh, for example like a old school pc game so you can let user type some action like a use or a move or a take or something like that so yeah however you want so so this is how you receive it like a user input whatever they typed mm. you can receive and uh, use it as a string thank you very much for watching and see you again bye